What's up, YouTube? LND here. Uh, today we're going to be playing some more Morrowind. And finally, probably after like 50 minutes, I finally killed this little shithead. Uh, I probably should get the fuck out of this area with how strong that guy is. I'm not lying. It took me probably about 50 minutes to finally kill him. And he doesn't even have anything on him. Completely empty. So... It's not like that isn't complete fucking bullshit. Uh. Oh, what the fuck? Of course, why would there be stuff on that guy? Oh my god, I need to. I, do I really need to get the fuck out of here? I'm also sorry that I ended that video the way I did, but come on guys, I couldn't even stand fucking up without him. The only reason that, only reason I ended up killing him is because I ended up getting him stuck on a fucking tree. Ah, uh, Cloud Cleaver. Harmer's obsession with that axe led to his death. I'll leave it with someone who can use it while I thank you for your help, stranger. I think that hot-headed would have killed me had you not intervened. Here, take this potions as my gift to you and seek me out if you ever require my service in the future. Journal updated. Exclusive restore health has been an exclusive, okay. Quality restore fatigue. Quality fortify health. Uh, join chat. Cut. Fuck, I didn't get to read that. Alright. Yes. Alright, alright. I need to get to the that's the last time I ever accept a quest from a naked person that's and the person like within like the entire time I was fighting about maybe double of the health I'm missing right now is about all I actually ever lost because he did so little damage to me but every time he hit me he ended up knocking me down then like as you could see in the last video Every time I went to fucking attack, it wouldn't let me attack for some reason. So, that's a fucking thing, apparently. That piece of poop head can go fuck himself. Alright, computer, we don't care. Or at least I don't. That better be a dead koala. It's a dead rat, but still... I think that's the angriest I've ever been in a video. Maybe. Like, I felt like I was about to punch my computer with how bullshit that was. Unfortunately, it's older games like this, stuff like that, turns people off from them. Morrowind is a great game. Had I not been... Have, have I not been... I don't know how to explain it. Fucking... If I wasn't wasn't like not caring as much as stuff about things that pissed me off in games. I that probably would have been the last time I ever played Morrowind. Come over here, you cliff racers. These things are fucking everywhere now. I'm not gonna hit them. Come on, just hit him. Alright, yeah, this this fighting shit is actually getting kind of old. I'm gonna run to the city. Please tell me that's a tree. Okay, good. Alright, the frame rate's probably about to eat absolute shit. Because f somehow cities are worse than outside with a bunch of trees and inside and caves with a bunch of other shit going on. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Uh, I can't expect anything more from my piece of shit computer, so. That was the first time I've been in Balmora since I updated the game. I think there's more. St Wait, maybe this isn't Balmora, though. I don't see the Silt Strider anywhere. 
Oh, this can't be Balmora. I did kind of just run into the city, though. It's clearly not a Silt Strider. What the fuck was that? Don't be surprised if my recording cuts out sometime soon. I don't quite remember when I started. I think I got into like 53 or well, 403. Alright. Where is Balmora? I'm gonna probably have to fight this cliff racer, so I probably should stop running, even though the fucking walk speed in this game is absolutely ridiculous. That's the thing you can tell with older games, games like Morrowind and Oblivion, your walk speed is actual walk speed, or your technically travel speed is walk speed in like Skyrim. And then your run speed is your sprint, or your normal speed that you travel at in Skyrim. And, uh... Your fucking sprint speed in this game, or is the normal travel speed, and then, like... I guess... The sprint speed in Skyrim would be fucking astronomical, the, the travel speeds in the, these games. Why are there so many fucking cliff racers around? This is Calderia. Alright, so I had to go back this way. I thought I I thought I went the right way to get to Balmora, but apparently not. Can I just fast travel? I don't think I can, but Calderia, Alderaan, and Balmora. Oh, why would you why would you be able to fast travel in an earlier game? That's some that's a problem I have with uh the first Dark Souls game. There was like four bonfires you can fast travel between, and in two you can use all of them. Spit on my screen. That's that touch screen motion. As you can make the character turn. I'm gonna get the fuck out of this city. All these weirdos. People in these games are actually kind of weird. Because they just fucking walk around and stare. Kind of like Daggerfall, they fucking just have like two f two different animations, like a walk animation and then like, well three I guess. Then they do something with their heads or arms or something. That thing is probably going to fucking attack me, so. Already sounds like I'm about to be attacked by Kawama or something. Unless it's that thing over there making that sound. Don't, don't even look at me. I don't fucking exist, okay? Don't you fucking do your fucking pound shit. Walk, oh, you f son of a bitch. Alright. Aha, you loser. Uh -huh. You're such a loser. Is it shitting out gas or what the fuck is going on? I feel bad that was kind of cheap to kill him through a rope. But that's what you get. That's pretty much what happened with that other guy. Just stuck him on a tree and he couldn't move. So, I wrecked his bitch ass. Is there a cave up here? I'd like to get a torch. I'm going to have to figure out how to... Oh, there just had to be another one. I'm actually going to get attacked by this one. I don't quite... I must be... Disease lit. Okay. I think that's kind of stupid that... Something can just fart on you and give you a disease, but all right then. All right, oh my guys, I gotta refresh the recording real quick. I'm gonna try to get better of just doing it, not saying shit. Excuse me, wall. Probably the ambient sound is what's doing that. I keep thinking I hear stuff coming after me. Although, with the way my characters look, I wouldn't be surprised if I was jumped by a bunch of stuff. I don't know what the fuck that's supposed to mean. Those things. I hey, wait a minute. Where is the fucking... I didn't even read the sign. I don't know. I have no idea if I'm going the right way. Although, really, this is the only way to go. Alright, you're dead rat. I 
could be wrong, but I kind of feel like the... I don't know, maybe it's just because of where I am the creatures are stronger. I really hope this isn't one of those games that the creatures increase. Oh, maybe it's because my weapon is starting to break. Oh, I'm not starting to break, but I need the standard restore health. I just want the one. I hate, hate, I hate those things so much. Fucking, I, if I click on it, I only want one, probably. And I hate it, and some things, like, will give you multiple, three things. You can, can't take them one at a time. But you can put them away one at a time, which is stupid. Alright, get over here, you Nickstown bitch. I can probably say this too now, and since it'll actually most likely make it into a real video, that'll be a real fucking thing. I think those Nixhounds kind of look like uh, mutated Argonians. Great right, home stretch. We're almost to Balmora. It's gonna be so funny when I get there and I can't fast travel because I have blight disease or something from that fucking blight storm that I was in for like maybe five minutes. Not not five minutes. Five seconds. Those things fucking happen all the time, too. And that is some sexy water. Alright, maybe, maybe, I think, I think the thing with my weapon not, or not doing enough, uh, doing as much damage is my weapon starting to break. Oh, you know what? I don't need to fast travel. Belmora is, uh, the place I wanted to go to. I'm thinking of, uh, the place you start, a city of Neen or whatever, I think. It's fucking load areas. Load walls. Yeah, I wanted to get to Balmora. Alright, I wonder if that was a... Was that, was that enough adventure for you guys? I don't even think I even recorded for 20 minutes yet. Actually, I, uh didn't do anything but traveled. I guess I can go for a little bit longer. God, the frame rate is atrocious in the cities. Although, I kind of would rather have it at a better quality looking than a higher frame rate, in, at least in my opinion. Hopefully soon within like the next four or five months I'll be getting a new computer that won't be absolute dick. Question? Nah. Let me guess. I won't travel. Uh, can I tell me, uh, travel. Okay, it looks like I can travel. Alright, go to Aldbrun. Just gonna go shit around for a little bit, I guess. See if I can find any caves. <sighs> it's like a slide. Actually, I should see what I need. I'll probably look it up later. I should find out what I need to do to be able to repair my weapon. <clears throat> probably can go to like a weapon shop. Actually, since I'm here. <clears throat> I actually do need a drink of water. Where the hell did my bottle go? Ah, uh, come here, baby. Uh, my lips are dry as fuck, but that's what happens when you fucking eat sunflower seeds for five or six hours. Alright, that's a mage thing. This, this has weapons and shield on it. Let's go in here. Let's see if I can repair my weapon. Might have to buy something to do it myself. I don't know. Did it, oh, I didn't go in. Alright, at first it made that sound. I thought it was starting to try to unlock it. Like it was lock picking. I don't know. Whoa, man. Whoa. Uh, call uh, latest rumors. Little advice. My trade. 
I'm a scout. Places, all right. This is, all right, goodbye. Goodbye. I don't think this is a, a shop, actually. Uh, oh, the fighter's killed. What? I'm such a fucking idiot. Sword and shield. Oh, maybe this is a shop. Goes in, doesn't read the name. Comes out, looks at it, realizes that it's a fucking fighter's guild. <laughs> Yes, yes, I know. The fuck is this? No, you speak. What the fuck? In. Okay, then all they had trampolines in this time. Council club. Don't I have? Haven't I been here before? Local. Council club. As in. Friends house. House. Bookseller. Pawnbroker. Smith. Alright, that's where I need to go. So I need to go up here. Ah, I remember. I remember. This place also got hit by a blight like practically every time I was in it. This better be the actual guy. Or chick. Uh, repair. I need my weapons repaired. The silver claymore. There we go. How is my armor doing? 85. And you know what? How much gold do I have? Does it say somewhere? Menus, tell me how much gold I have. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's a fucking item in this game. 1,709. Uh, let's see. Alright. I'm just going to repair all this armor. It's probably all I need. I repaired just the... Alright, that's probably good. Bye, bitch! Okay, so we repaired the armor, we fought some stuff, we made it to Balmora, fast travel to Aldrin. Now we just need to find a cave to enter so I can show how dark it is in caves. Actually, I already showed that in the last video. Oh, you know what? I wonder if a pawnbroker will sell a torch. Although, that's going to kind of suck. Nah, I guess it's just going to have to be a thing I have to deal with. Because I can't hold a torch and a weapon, or I can't hold the torch in the weapon I use, because I use a two-handed weapon. Shink. Those natches are actually kind of scary. I wonder what Skyrim would be like if those things were actually walking around and stuff. I like how somehow people tame those things to just carry people around places. I guess you probably raise them from when they're a baby and they actually get to know you and shit, but that's just fucking weird. It's just fucking weird. Alright, what's this sign say? Margan. Alright, uh, Aldrin Buckmouth Legion Fort. Uh, let's go to Margan. What the fuck? Oh! Oh, just saying. With the ways the trees are, and the sun shafts, or whatever those are called, I thought that rock was actually see-through. Alright, computer, it's okay, it's okay, I'm, I'm almost done with the video. Then you can take a break. Why are there so many goddamn Nyx hounds over here? Fight me, bruh! Oh, poochie. Damn, that did, that did, uh, oh, I'm, I had the stamina up. I, I need to go to a store and buy something that increases my stamina. And I also need to quit fucking running everywhere. Alright, you're dead, Nyx Hound. Oh, by the way, see, these Nyx Hounds I killed in, like, like, hold on. 
Let me prove my point. I kill him in two hits. The ones at the other place, it was taking like five or six hits, so. It's kind of bad, at, honestly, because I don't think, well, compared to Skyrim, I guess, you don't really see a bunch of random enemies with different levels just, like, slopped around in a bunch of different areas. And, like, things like wolves don't increase in level and because of different areas. They stay the same level. I need to quit running. Oh, don't see me, rat. I think I have enough stamina to actually take on that rat. I hope there's, like, a thing around here. Are you rat bastard? <laughs> Get it? Rat bastard? It's a joke. Come over here, you Kwamas. Whoa, what in the fuck? I'm not gonna touch that. I'm afraid I'm gonna die. Seriously? That'd be dope with that netch took on that cliff racer and just like swallowed him whole. Whoa! Oh, that's my magicka. I shat my pants when I thought. I thought my health was almost all gone. Is it actually called Magicka in this game? Probably is. I don't know why it would change. I don't think it's actually called Magicka and Daggerfall and stuff though. Holy shit, this area is big. I'm climbing the fucking Pyramid of Giza. There are so many rats. Alright. Probably actually going on about 20 minutes, 25 minutes or so, so I think I'm going to end the video here. Uh, this video was way less productive, way more relaxing, and not stress-inducing. And that's a win-win in my book. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thanks for watching the video. If you'd like to be notified when my new content is released, click the subscribe button on the right. If you're looking for something a little bit different, why not go check out the recent Let's Play I did with Advanced Darkness on Hero Siege. Or, if you're in the mood for something spooky, test your courage with my playthrough of Five Nights at Freddy's 2.